Hey, Dorico Cherry coming at you again today from DoricoCherry.com. I want to cut this quick video for you today to help you to help you with content creation and more specifically who you ex who you should be creating content for. So make sure you stick around. Okay, so I got this question from a conversation I was having with someone the other day, and I thought I'd share it with you. And their question was, how do they come up with content uh, for their blog or just content in general? And this is what I told them. When you're actually coming up with content, looking for things to talk about, the person that you come up with content through uh, investing in courses, books, uh, training, webinars, things like that, and you take information from there, and then that's how that's what you share with your audience. Now, another question that they had was, um, well, not another question, but the way I broke it down a little further was, you want to make sure that you're you're teaching, um, and this is especially true if you're if you're brand new, um, you want to make sure that you're teaching day one you. And what do I mean by that? Day one you is you want to teach the person who is just coming online, um, who's just getting started, um, things that you're learning. So you're not out here, you know, trying to teach the gurus or anything like that. Now, keep in mind, you know, once your your uh, marketing career has progressed and you've advanced in it, then you may, you know, later on down the road, you may have uh, gurus buying your products and reaching out to you for things. But if you're just getting started out, um, that is not who your target audience is. That's not who you should be teaching. And I and I personally had that hang up too when I first got started online. I was thinking that man, you know, I got to be teaching. Um, you know, I got to come up with all this great content, and uh, you know, it's got to be something all brand new, and I got to come up with all this stuff. That is not the case. You know, if you're on a webinar and you learn something cool, flip that camera on, share it with your audience. I can guarantee you there's somebody out there who was not on that webinar um, who, who, who would love the information that you're actually sharing with them. So um, I hope that helps you out a little bit. Um, I hope that clear helps clear things up. And uh, if you like this type of training and you want to be notified more of it, head on over to DoricoCherry.com and throw your name and email address in there. And just for doing that, I'm going to give you access to a free Instagram cheat sheet that's going to show you how to get 21 plus leads a day for your network marketing business. I hope you're having an awesome day. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.